Hello and welcome to Dinosaur Juice. And well, we're in my little smart roadster and we're heading off to Ambley Working Museum where they've got pre-1956 cars. So that should be fantastically interesting. Obviously, none of my cars are that old. The oldest car that I have is the MG, which is from 1974. So I'm not displaying, just going to have a look. Yeah, but cars of that era are, it's just the golden age, isn't it, of the, of the sports car. But obviously sports cars, British sports cars continued after that. Um, and that's fine, you know, but just that era of the, the, the Grand Tours and just exquisitely beautiful and unique cars were just incredible like the, the Jags, the XK 120s and things like that so yeah it should be a really interesting show and uh, I went quite a few years ago and had a lot of pre David Brown Aston Martins, so pre war Aston Martins and they're lovely to look at absolutely lovely to look at and I love this museum just normally, Ambley Working Museum is a fantastic museum so yeah, I'm very much looking forward to that. In a way, I don't think there's much more to say on that, so I'll catch you when we get there. So we've arrived at Amberley Merkin Museum, and even in the car park there's some interesting cars. Here, start with a Mini, then a Merlin kit car. And you hardly ever see these down south, so... That's quite interesting. And it's got a caravan as well, a carbon fibre caravan with wood panelling. That's quite weird. You've got a smart roaster, I mean, they're awesome. Yeah, that's my car. <laughs> cool old Ford pickup truck. I believe this is for sale. Yeah. There you go. Don't see many of those in the UK. This old Ford definitely meets the uh, the date criteria, so why it's out here and not inside is beyond me, but have you seen the suspension on these? It's fantastic. Coal springs and a leaf spring. That's a lovely little thing. Yeah. Nice to see well any old car but something as old as this. And then over here it's old Riley. Or is that Walsley? Wolsey. Yeah, it's a Wolsey. Uh, there you go, shows what I know about sports cars of this particular era. Look at that. I just... I need one of these next. <laughs> and here's a Riley. Nice old thing. Fantastic, with the suicide doors at the front. Conventional doors at the rear, so they're hinged in the centre. It's beautiful. Yeah, really forgotten about brand, but made some amazing cars. Ford Popular, again one that meets the date criteria, so why is it out here and not in there? Again, beyond me. That lovely little British Ford, from the very early days of British Fords. Lovely. And everyone's sorted if they need a haircut for the day. I didn't make those jokes, so I drive a smart road, so... <laughs> Thank you. 
if you follow my videos closely, I remember a very long time ago I did a video about the car that got me into cars and it was one of these, a Morgan Super Sports. Lovely little thing. My dad used to have one in green and he also had a another Morgan Freewheeler, a little earlier one, but both of them were fantastic. And there's just little things that are coming back to me, like the, the exposed valves, the rocker arms of the valves, and the, the carburetor that um, he didn't have an electronic fuel pump or a pump connected to the problem, so you have to tickle it with this little button, button here. That primes the carburetor so you can start it. And then you can crank it, or some of them were fitted with an electric starter. Yeah, it's a lovely, lovely little thing, and it's such a beautiful car. There's just something so elegant about this particular era of Morgan three wheels. And front suspension on this is genius as well. I took some pictures of it earlier. Museum, what a fantastic day! Such lovely cars, lovely people, and just uh, just an environment where you can really sort of engage with everything. It's a wonderful museum and a fantastic uh, car show today. Um, I highly recommend that you go even when there isn't an event on, and if there is an event on, definitely it's, it's definitely worth it. Um, yeah fantastic um anyway thank you for watching please like and subscribe uh and i'll see you in the next one